A surprise delivery for the employees at a local Casey's this morning. What started out as a pit stop turned a Casey's restroom into a delivery room. KCCI's Aaron Hazanzada has the unusual story of how a Greenfield couple welcomed their newborn. Yeah, that's right, Kevin and Stacy. It was a strange morning at the Casey's in Greenfield where one employee working the graveyard shift got more than she bargained for. I thought it would be a nice, calm night. <laughs> that didn't happen. <laughs> Amanda Tease was working the graveyard shift early Thursday morning at this Casey's in Greenfield when a familiar face walked in. I said, Hi, Abby, how are you? What are you doing in here at 2 30 in the morning? She said, I think I'm in labor. I'm heading to the hospital. Abby Henricks, who's from Greenfield, was stopping to use the Casey's restroom on her way to the Creston Hospital just 30 miles away. Yep. That's all she done. And she didn't make it. <laughs> when Amanda went to check on Abby just four minutes later, but she was calm as can be and she just said, I just delivered my baby. <laughs> Abby had her baby here in the Casey's bathroom. She never screamed. I didn't even know she was delivering. It was within four minutes. Amanda ran to tell Abby's mother, husband, and son who were waiting for her in the car. Her husband was pretty quiet, and her mom just ran in here, and she's like, are you serious? Amanda's reaction? Um, you got to be kidding me. Dispatch had a similar response. When I called in, he said she's in labor, and I'm like, no, she had a baby. And she's like, oh, she's having a baby. And I'm like, no, she had the baby. Oh, okay, I'll call them right away. When Amanda called 911, emergency responders didn't have far to go. They came from right next door. She was actually very calm and was just excited about the fact that it was a girl. A little girl named Addison Nicole Henricks. Seven pounds, 12 ounces, and a great story to tell about how she came into the world. Yep, she wasn't born in the hospital. She was born at Casey's. Now, the Adair County Hospital, where baby Addison was first taken, does not deliver babies. So Addison was taken from Greenfield to Creston, where she is now. And how, how is Addison doing tonight? Yeah, well, we talked to her mom, and she said that her and the baby are both doing just fine. Good for them. Yep. Thank you, Erin. <laughs>